So vermouth is an aromatized and fortified wine. Um, what that means is that aromatized, it's got, it's had the addition of certain herbs, barks, roots, extract, etc. fortified and that extra alcohol has been added to it. The history of consuming fortified aromatized wine or fortified wine with additives goes all the way back to China for medicinal purposes. Uh, in Greece, uh, we see people infusing white wine with various herbs. Um, and it continued down through the, through the ages into the medieval period uh, where it became a little bit more common. And in Germany, it became known as Wermut, uh, which is where we get the common word for vermouth today. Wermut being the German word for wormwood, which is one of the most common additives that you find in, uh, in, in vermouth. Uh, typically and historically, it comes in one of two styles. Of course, you have red vermouth or white vermouth. But in recent years, there have been rosé and amber and all these other different kinds. Historically speaking, red is sweet, white is a little bit more dry, um, and they run the gamut from kind of sweeter French styles in general to really robust, earthy, and botanically Italian styles. Um, there are some made in the United States, but not a whole heck of a lot, uh, and they tend to be uh, a little less herby, a little less bitter, and a little bit more sort of rounded fruity. Uh, but yeah, put them in your cocktail, use them as a digestive aid.